There were two dogs at my school that attracted all the attention. Hey, it's Kureha Ninomiya! Stop talking so loud! If she hears you, you'll end up in the hospital. I heard that she beat up a punk gang leader from another school the other day. Just as you'd expect from Kureha the mad dog. Why don't any of the teachers stop her, though? I guess they're afraid of her, too. This has nothing to do with me. I shouldn't get involved. I'm just gonna finish my daily duties and head home early. My name is Yuichi Rosano, and I'm a sophomore in high school. I'm probably classified as a simple and quiet type of guy, but I want to be known as a guy who does what he has to do when he has to do it. I was about to go to the garbage dump, when? It's Kureha Ninomiya. What's she doing in front of the storage shed? Don't tell me she's gonna beat someone up in there. I'm so curious. A few minutes later, no one's come out and it's been very quiet. Too quiet for her to have beaten someone up in there. Maybe she beat them up before they had time to scream. What? Why is Mizuki Ichinose, the student council president, coming out of the storage shed? What happened to Kureha Ninomiya? Mizuki Ichinose was the student council president and was known as the loyal dog because of her loyalty to the school. When she was out of sight, I hurriedly looked inside the storage shed. There's no one here. What the heck is going on? I spent the whole day trying to figure out what happened in that shed, but I couldn't come up with anything. The next day, I saw Mizuki at school. What's wrong with your uniforms? Your ties need to be pulled up properly. Who would do such a lame thing? Stop being so bossy or I'm gonna make you cry. Violence isn't allowed in school. We're from the ex-leader Shiho Endo's gang. You know what'll happen if you mess with us. Then do whatever you want. Do you know what you're saying? Oh gosh, I have to help her, but my legs won't move. Please stop. What, what the, the heck? heck? Violence isn't tolerated at this school. Don't try and act cool. Your legs are shaking. I'm not shaking. If you're that scared, you should move. You're in my way. I'm not moving. I don't want to be the type of scum who runs away. Hey, what are you guys doing? We luckily escaped from the pinch thanks to the teacher's arrival. The punks ran away. Whew. Are you okay? Somehow. Thanks for saving me. I'm actually a karate expert. I was planning on finishing them off with a single blow when the right time came. Then I should have stayed out of it. No, you shouldn't have. What? It was the first time in my life that I've been protected like that. I was so happy someone treated me like a girl. May I ask your name? My name is Yuichiro Sano. I'm a sophomore. Brave and handsome Yuichiro. Now that we've met, I'd like to talk to you more. Huh? Seeing Mizuki's smile sparked the beginning of my popularity at school. The next day... Yuichiro, say ah! Hey, wait, student council president! What the heck, Yuichiro? You should do whatever the student council president says! So, she's into guys like you. Yuichiro, what's wrong? I'm not in a position to have the student council president do this to me. Never mind. I'm just trying to feed my favorite sophomore. You're baiting me! I see his face! Mm -mm. How is it? It's alright. You're cute. It was strange to be called cute by a girl. Mizuki's adherence continued after school. You also walk home in this direction? No, I usually go in the opposite direction, but I want to spend as much time as possible with you. P please stop being so cute. I'm gonna faint. It made me happy, even if you were joking, though. I wasn't joking. I think I've fallen in love with you. Huh? You've never been in a fight, have you? And that you stood up to those punks to defend me. It was very endearing. I'm a karate expert, and I've always had a very black and white personality. People don't like me because I've got a bit of a manly side. Now that I'm student council president, I'm even more of a target. It's no wonder I'm attracted to you. You still treated me like a girl. 
Please make me your girlfriend. I'm glad you like me so much. I'm sure I'll never meet another person in my life who likes me the way you do. So we can be together? You're the first boyfriend I've ever had. That's how I got with my first girlfriend. By the way, I'm taking tomorrow off from school, Yuichiro. Why? I need to go to the hospital regularly. What's wrong? It's nothing serious. You don't need to worry, but I'll miss you. She'd always say cute things about me and the time we spent together. I thought our love would last forever. At lunchtime the next day, Kareha Ninomiya showed up in my classroom and started picking on me. Here, here, eat it. No, stop it! What's wrong with you? Why are you picking on me, Kareha? It's just a whim. I just felt like bothering you. Aren't you dating the student council president? Don't tell me you're in a love triangle with this girl, too. Stop it! I have a girlfriend, and this kind of contact with other girls isn't good for me. <laughs> you're so single-minded. You must really love her. I couldn't understand why Kareha Ninomiya had suddenly decided to pick on me. I was puzzled. That mad dog Kareha was stuck to me more than I liked. Slowly, rumors spread about me being in a love triangle with the two dogs. I instantly became the most famous person in school. Oh, so he's Kareha's boyfriend. Interesting. I'm Shiho Endo. Before Kareha Ninomiya, I was the school's punk gang leader. Most of my time is now spent trying to bring down Kareha. After school that day. Hey, popular guy. Whoa! Who are you? You don't know me? I'm sorry. Do we have any mutual friends at school? At school? Don't tell me you don't know who Shiho Endo is. Shiho Endo? Didn't she used to be the school's punk gang leader before Kareha showed up? That's me! Really? It's you? Don't worry. I didn't come here today to fight. Then what you want? I'm here to ask you something. Yeah? You're Kareha Ninomiya's boyfriend, right? No, I'm not. She's just harassing me. Doesn't matter either way. She likes you, so that's enough for me. What you mean? She took everything from me. My position as a leader and my friends. Well, there are still some friends who follow me. But now it's my turn to take away what's important to her. And that's you. Please don't be rough. What you doing? Mizuki! Look who it is. The student council president. What you want? I'm busy right now. That guy's my boyfriend. Get away from him! Wait, are you trying to start a fight with me? Let's do it. What? Don't think I'll go easy on you like before. Oh, you're not. You finally realized. How didn't I see it? Mizuki, the loyal dog, came out of the same shed that Kureha, the mad dog, had gone into. I should have figured that out. I'm Kureha Ninomiya. <laughs> Students from our school happened to be passing by and started making a commotion. I knew we were in a bad situation. Mizuki, this way! I grabbed her and ran away. We arrived at the riverbed. Mizuki, please explain what's going on. I was trying to unite the punk gangs. What? Our school is infested with punks because of Shiho Endo, the ex-gang leader. The teachers and I, the head of the student council, were having a hard time with it. So I became the leader of the punk gang to make sure they didn't do anything reckless. Fortunately, I've trained in karate so I could deal with any situation that arose. Once a fortnight, with the teacher's permission, I'd come to school as Kureha Ninomiya. So that's why the teachers always leave Kureha alone. But what was it that I saw that day? That day? I saw Kureha go into the storage shed. And then for some reason, you came out of it. Did you see that? I had to change my clothes in a hurry because I remembered that I had to work for the student council. You were entrusted with such an important mission? And you chose to change your clothes in a storage shed? That's so risky! I know. I had to play both characters perfectly. But as a result of my actions, I blew my cover and you found out what I was doing. There's one more thing I don't understand. 
Why did you act so differently from the usual Kureha during lunch break today? Wasn't it strange of her to try and make me eat her sandwich? I couldn't resist it when I saw your face. Huh? I forgot I was Kureha and wanted to flirt with you. I couldn't control myself. It's embarrassing to hear you say that to my face. Are you disillusioned to find out I have two sides to me? I didn't want to show you this side. Of course not. You're putting your body on the line for the school. I'm not disillusioned. I'm even more in love with you. I love you. Whoa. The next day. Korea Nina Mia's true identity is Mizuki Ichinose. What? Shiho, is that true? I'm sure your grief at being relieved of your position as gang leader must have been very deep. But I didn't realize that you were depressed enough to make this up. I won't believe that the student council president is Kareha Ninomiya. I'm not insane. She told me to my face. It'll be impossible to take her down now. The whole school is probably involved in this plot. Shiho left the rooftop looking sad. Mizuki is good looking, gets excellent grades, and is superhuman. She'd never get in a fight. Should we all switch and start following her? Kareha's true identity came to light at school, and I feared that there would be fierce criticism of Mizuki. However, the opposite happened. She became respected by all of the students. I'm happy for you, Mizuki. I'm so proud to have you, who worked so hard to improve the school, as my girlfriend. Don't say it like that, it's embarrassing. Mizuki had been very busy with the student council recently, but our relationship carried on, of course. I love you. You're so bold in public, and your tone of voice is starting to sound like Kareha's. She's a fun person. I still haven't found a way to measure her charm. 